there are pockets, and you have to look at it as, as a holograph, holographic projection of light. When you put a shadow into a light, it creates a, a variance of the light. Well, apparently what happens is, is things that don't um, ascend or choose to take higher consciousness, they get very, very heavy in weight or in light, whatever you want to call it. And as everything starts to exceed up, bulges, dips in light are created, in frequency are created. And what happens is negativity forms, because of its weight, its heaviness, forms into these pockets. Well, what happens is they form a sack. And eventually what happens is, is those sacks break. And because everything is spirit and nothing is ever wasted, they form, when they explode, they, they cast themselves out and they form another universe. They create a space for them to continue. Well, that's how our black holes are. That's how they were formed. Those black holes, if we could get through them, would be to another universe. They're portals. And it would just explode out. Well, that's how our universe was created. Well, because of this new energy that's being, um, that's being formed, pockets are, of resistance are now being formed all through, the, all through the universe. And in our galaxy, it's, it's right now between us and Cirrus. So the way that the Andromeda's plan to remove the Alpha Draconians would be is basically to try to contain them and and the en their own energy themselves will suck them into a place of darkness so they can move out into another place. The Greys, the Orion groups, this is going to happen. It's happened before. Um, they know it's happening now and this is why everybody feels this intense energy. Things are suddenly really starting to increase and, and it's simply because it is increasing. So at a um, prior time, then, they were sucked out of another universe into Alpha Draconis? Is that basically what, essentially what happened? They were sucked from wherever they were into another universe. How somehow that universe, or the beings in that universe, wherever they came from, say, we got to get rid of these guys, and they literally brought them here from their universe and dumped them and said, boom, this is where you are. Because they came here in physical form, which means they had to have been brought here. They didn't evolve like every, all the other life forms here have evolved. They were brought here in full physical form, which means they were created someplace else and dumped here and said, you know, your history. Well, someplace else, then, there's some very irresponsible people. Yeah, well, I, you know, maybe at some point in our eternal history we'll be able to address that issue. You know, but for right now we need to address our own issues. Okay, let's go to the World Club then to end this up um, and future events. According to the Andromedans, mankind has been manipulated for 5,724 years. Human agents must have participated in this throughout history. Who are some of the major players in this deception? You mentioned Hitler and the Giza intelligence. Uh, most of the pharaohs, um, most of the ancient Egyptian gods. Um, I mean, there's so many. I. I, I couldn't honestly tell you. I mean, history is chock full of it. Uh, I think what people need to do is to go back and look at what we call mythology and really start giving it a second look. Uh, uh, Richard, Richard Thompson, in his book, although I've not read it, but I've heard others talk about where he, he, del he delves into the history of things. Um, now, and, and it's also important to remember that just because it's history doesn't mean it's accurate history. You know, because it, it has been proven over and over and over again, whoever wins the war rewrites history. They write it to their benefit, to glorify themselves. And it doesn't mean that that's, that's really what happened. And according to the Andromedans, our next major leaps in consciousness are going to come from science and archaeology. It isn't going to come from any spiritual leader or teachings. It's going to come from science to say, you know what, this, here's the proof, this is true, this is reality, and I don't know what this stuff is. We can't prove that, you know. And, it, and it's time we really start paying attention. Maybe at a future time we can, okay. we can, we can share more or do another interview or something. In a specific way, please describe in detail what the World Club is and who comprises it, and offer some specific examples of how they're controlling the rest of us. Um, well. The banking circles, maybe? Yeah, it's all, it all evolves around money. The World Bank, International Monetary Fund. I mean, they've got the whole world in debt. You know, governments are giving away their, their mineral rights in perpetuity. The United States government is, in, is now in a position to declare uh, a 